You want to know how I use these regular white candles to make beautiful, colorful and scented candles as this? Then all you have to do is to watch this video till the end without skipping because I'm going to share every detail on how I made it in this video. Welcome back to my channel. Please don't forget to subscribe, like and share. The first thing I did was getting my regular candles ready, which is my regular white candles and just as you can see, they are six in numbers and that's what I'll be using. The next thing I did was putting them in a pan or pot, you can put them in a pan or pot or anything at all, you can double boil it or or use a pan or pot to place it directly on a very low heat remember i said very low heat so while i was waiting for that to melt i proceeded to getting my colors ready i am using this crayon just for you to know that you can use crayon for that so i am using blue and green color for this projects for this experiment that's my baby's hand <laughs> so i proceeded to peeling the back off to removing the paper from the crayon that's the color that i am using After peeling off the bag, I proceeded to breaking it into two just so it can enter whatever I'm using to melt it. So I use this particular stainless to melt the colors. While melting it, I noticed that my candle is already ready for use. So I quickly took off the wick, the candle wick from the um, candle wask. And this is also my color. I use double boiling method to melt my color. You can as well place it directly on a very low heat. Okay. Now these are my wigs. They are all dry. They are all ready to use. I am going to be using the wick that came out from the regular candles. Okay. I already had my hanging sticks ready. So all I did was that I tied my candle wick at the center of my hanging stick so that it will not fall to one side when I place it in my container. So this is how I tied it and yeah this is how it is looking like. So and I will go ahead to tie others the same way. So this is what I'll be using to make my scented candles like this video is just a pure diy this is actually bottle that i had to cut by myself and don't worry in my next video i'll be showing you how i cut the bottle because i don't want to keep you in suspense you can also do it this way if you cannot get a jar to put your candle was you can actually cut your wine bottles your you know instead of discarding them you just cut it use it to recycle them and use it for your candle for your scented candles for your beautiful candles like you can use it for a lot of other things okay so just stay tuned and make sure you share this video I'll be using lavender fragrance for some of the candles. I really love lavender. I love the fragrance. Like that's my best fragrance, honestly. So I'll be using it for part of the candles. And also I will use um, cinnamon, clove, stannis, and some other herbs for some candles. Just keep watching, okay? And don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not done so. Don't forget to share it. And don't forget to let me know your opinion in the comment section. Dropping in some lavender fragrance in my green candles. Honestly, you need to perceive this candle when it's burning. It scents heavenly. I have 
green candle, I have plain white and I have blue candle. So after pouring it like this, I set it into my fridge and it's hardened. But I noticed that the candles did not totally close up, probably because of the fridge. I think if you set it in a, a very safe place where children or no one will go and tamper with it, it will come out closed up because freezer or fridge always do this kind of a thing to something when it's trying to get hardened so i have here um white green and blue candle the other one is mixture of blue and green that is why it's looking that color so i just want it to be in different colors in those ones i have cinnamon cloves star anise and what again then in the other one too i also have cinnamon cloves and star anise then in the other two i have my favorite lavender fragrance in there And let's test our work to be sure that is even bunny you no know, because <laughs> so it's actually burning and it sounds so nice like the room or anywhere you keep this candle is going to be filled up with nice fragrance like i just love it i love it if you have watched to this extent i really appreciate you let me know in the comment section if you'll be trying this scented candle using this procedure and don't forget to like this video give it a thumbs up and don't forget to share don't also forget to subscribe so that by the time i post my video on how i cut my wine bottle you will not miss that video so i let her fill in the holes and it came out so well don't forget to stay safe out there and see you in my next video